Nissan has begun the process of choosing Gon's successor, with the final decision expected on December 17. Tokyo, Japanese prosecutors formally charged Carlos Gon with financial misconduct for underreporting his salary and also served a fresh warrant on separate allegations, local media reported Monday, meaning the tycoon will likely spend Christmas in a cell. Former Nissan chairman Ghosn, 64, has been in detention since his November 19 arrest on suspicion of under-declaring his income by some 5 billion yen $44 million between 2010 and 2015. Authorities then re-arrested him later Monday over separate allegations that he also under-reported his income by a further 4 billion over the past three years. Under Japanese law, suspects can be re-arrested several times for different allegations, allowing prosecutors to question them for prolonged periods, a system that has drawn criticism internationally. Monday was the final day prosecutors could hold Gone and close aide Greg Kelly before either charging or re-arresting them, and a further arrest could allow them another 22 days of questioning. In addition to charges against Gone, prosecutors also indicted Kelly and Nissan itself, according to local media, as the company submitted the official documents that under-reported the income. Gone denies the charges and is in a combative frame of mind, according to sources at Renault, the company he still formally leads, even if the French car giant has appointed an interim chairman. The Japanese firms in the three-way alliance with Renault, Nissan and Mitsubishi Motors have both sacked the Franco-Lebanese Brazilian as chairman. The millionaire auto sector star, who attracted some criticism for a perceived lavish lifestyle, is now alone in a Spartan cell in a Tokyo detention center, in a tiny room measuring just three to Tommy mats, around five square meters. He has reportedly told embassy visitors he is being well-treated but has complained of the cold, with Monday's temperature in the Japanese capital hovering around 5 degrees Celsius. He spends his time reading books and news reports and is said to be unhappy about the rice-based food. According to local news agency Kyoto, he has admitted signing documents to defer part of his salary until after retirement but said this amount did not need to be declared as it has not yet been definitively fixed. A source close to the investigation has said Gon and Kelly allegedly put the system in place after a new law came in obliging the highest paid members of the firm to declare their salary. Gon is suspected of deferring part of his pay to avoid criticism from staff and shareholders that his salary was too generous. Nissan is appealing to court in Rio de Janeiro to block access by Gon's representatives to a luxury apartment on Copacabana Beach. We are closely watching if he is actually indicted and then found guilty, said Satoru Takata, an analyst at TIW, a Tokyo-based research and consulting firm. If he is exempted from prosecution or found innocent, it is going to create huge confusion in Nissan's management, Takata told AFP. It is unclear if Gon can be bailed before a potential trial. In Japan, prosecutors and defendants begin a trial at a district court and can appeal to a high court in the Supreme Court. It may take several years before reaching a final judgment. If found guilty, Gon could face a 10-year prison sentence. The affair represents a staggering turnaround for a figure celebrated for saving Nissan from the brink of bankruptcy and rebuilding it as a money-making subsidiary of Renault. Nissan has begun the process of choosing Gon's successor, with the final decision expected on December 17. His arrest has sparked incredulity at Renault, which owns 43% of Nissan and says it has not seen a detailed account of the charges against Gon. It has also fueled anger in Lebanon, with digital billboards around Beirut proclaiming, We are all Carlos Gon, under a picture of the magnate. A Lebanese phoenix will not be scorched by a Japanese sun, Interior Minister Nohad Maknouk has declared. Japan to indict Nissan as well as Carlos Ghosn, report Nissan Motor Delay's decision on Carlos Ghosn's successor Carlos Ghosn arrest lays bare frustration at Nissan Nissan plans to drive in half a dozen subs Nissan targets mass market EVs commenting feature is disabled in your country, region.